No, once again, I want to be with my husband. Oh, oh God, no. I have now. Regret. Instant regret. Yeah, what are you talking about? <laughs> All right, look, Richard. Richard! Yeah, make sure you hit this one. We're trying everything in the November 2021 Keto Crate right after this. Smash the Crate, the monthly series where I, along with my husband and my mother, try every item in this month's Keto Crate. Okay, this one's a doozy. First of all, stick around to the end to see if you are the winner of this Keto Crate. But once again, if you weren't, don't worry because you can use the link in the description box below to get one. And I definitely recommend you do that because this Keto Crate is lit. Okay, let go. Are we ready? This crate is on fire. Oh, sorry. Oh. First, we're starting. Here's the thing. Meat, meat stick, right? And I'm like, oh, meat stick. But look, maple and pepper. Ooh. Like, oh, right? You like those right? Things. I know. I literally said that. I was like, I like those things. I hate meat sticks, but I love me some maple oh, and some yeah. pepper, right? Here comes the flavors. So let's see. Exactly. Let's see what this is like. Here we go. All right. Lego. Let's taste the flavor. No maple, no pepper. <laughs> All disappointment. One moment, please. Hold on. Stand by. You get the pepper right there? I don't even like that flavor. Whatever that is, I don't like that. It was maple and pepper. Mm. Minus really, the maple. I really enjoy it. <laughs> no. mm -mm. I mean, it was a little sweeter. Yeah. That's what? Maple. No. Mm -mm. I mean, it was a little sweeter. You were making that it up. It doesn't taste maple. Okay, maple so maple you maple. guys know, and if you don't know, I don't like meat sticks. Nothing against that meat stick. It could have been very well excellent. Yes. I don't like meat sticks. So for me, that was a tier four. Oh. Say tier two for the only reason it's not fatter. And God, he loves these more, fatties. I like more, three. more dense. Okay, so our rating system, if you're unfamiliar, tier one means it's on the highest tier, right? We're stepping down, right? I uh, love it. I would purchase it. I have purchased it. This tastes delicious and it's definitely worth the money. Mm -hmm. Tier two, mm, you know, this is good. I wouldn't necessarily buy it, but like it was good enough. Like if someone gave it to me for free, I would definitely keep it and be okay with it, right? Yes. Tier number three. Yeah, not my favorite sort of thing, but really good in like a break glass in case of emergency. Like I'm not reaching for it first, and I'm not buying. I'm not buying it. Definitely but not. if somebody gave it to me, ah, you, you know, in the snack drawer, and maybe, and maybe I reach it one point. day, right? And then tier four is I do not like that. I would not pay for it. If someone offered it to me for free, I would decline it, right? Mm -hmm. And that's a lot. Like I'll, I'll take, I'll take most anything. It's so when I decline something, that means I just really don't like it. No. Mm -mm. Even no, mostly meat sticks. So yeah, so that's our rating oh, system. So for me, that was a tier four. I would never get that. And if someone gave it to me, I'd be like, I'm not gonna eat this. I'm not going to. You know. So I didn't like it. No. I'd go tier two. Mm -mm. I'm a three. Mm -mm. Can't do it. Field trip crispy cuts island barbecue. We've had these several times, right? So we know all about them. Mm, look, look how puffy they are. Ooh, wow, I'm taking this That's one. That's always how field trip rolls. They are. Field trip is puffy. Okay, let go. Mm. Faulty. Mm. I don't taste the barbecue like the sweetness, maybe? That's the Apparently. Island. No. The, the, mm. the flavor is not pungent. Mm. Okay. It really just tastes like salt for me. This is a tier three, mm -hmm. right? This is how most savory snacks are for me. Like I'm saving those to the end because I love sweets. So if I get a savory snack, I'll just put it back in the back. It might expire. I don't know, right? But the flavor is good. Once again, not bad. Yep. It tastes yeah, I've good. Had other, I've had other better brands. Yeah. Tier two. Yeah. Just because of the other better. Yeah. Flavors. So yeah, this will be okay. Two point five for me. No, no. Moving along, more chips. Mm, yeah. We have Genius Gourmet. The ranch, we have ranch, um, <clears throat> potato chips, the snack chips, they call them. This white powder is very white. Mm -hmm. like, is that the flavor? This looks like it's frosted. White flavor. No, it's What's ranch. Hold it up, hold it up in front of your face. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, this looks more like it was dusted in powdered sugar. I like what it it's looks like, though. Oh, yeah, these, gen oh, these Genius Gourmet chips are amazing. Okay, I let's go. I need to rethink about the bag, though. It's like half the bag, at least. Yep, I'll take another one. I don't mind that at all. I mean, mm -hmm. the the 
sight is quite off-putting. <laughs> like, it literally looks like powdered sugar. That's how white and powdery it is, mm -hmm. you know? I'm but, like white I like that. But once again, nice. the texture is good. The flavor of that is good. Honestly, yeah. it's not particularly ranchy. Mm -hmm. It's yeah, more of like a white cheddar. I was going to say, that's not a ranch, right? No, now. it's not like what you would typically expect to say, like, oh, that's a ranch flavored it's a very, chip. It's very, very subtle ranch. But, it's probably more buttermilk than ranch. Yes, but the flavor is delicious. Yes, the is. texture is delicious. Mm -hmm. Like, that's a, for me, that's a tier two. Yeah. I would, somebody gave this yeah. to me, I would be excited. Yeah. I would yeah. equally say tier two yeah, as well. Me as well. Look at three. Two, two, two. Okay. You guys, if you don't know, my order is from like things that I'll like, I think that I'll like the least, to things that I'll like the most, right? So I try to get Which all the bad that, stuff out of the way. Of me, because it's always, mm -hmm. start off with things I love. Love it and go to the things you like the least. Yeah, so that means we always start off savory. Done. We're already done with, with what he likes? No, no, we have a couple more savory items. So we start no. savory, we move into sweets. We save the best for last, like Vanessa Williams says. Okay. I'm pretty sure it's the opposite. Crazy Go Nuts Hawaiian Barbecue Walnuts. Sure so out now. With I'm just like, mmm, Hawaiian barbecue walnuts, though. But ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> I get two little raggedy. Here, Christina. Um, I get all of these. Like the seasoning Cream looks baked on, seasoned. caked on, mm -hmm. sort of thing. Okay, let's go. Like through some kind of uh, maybe olive oil or something. Mm. They're very soft. They are them. soft. The I think that's because of like the liquid that's on them, mm -hmm. like or the, the barbecue sauce. Mm -hmm. I don't like that. Yeah. They were kind of mushy. The flavor wasn't even that good for it to mix with the bark, like mm -hmm. with the walnut. I would have rather just had walnuts, right? Walnuts covered in barbecue sauce and then dehydrated is not my thing. No, they for me, that's a tier four. Yeah, it's a tier four to me. Nuts. The only reason I ate all of those is because I complained I only got a little, so you know. I to save you. Yeah, she did. Um, so it was my bad on that I would, one. But I would no. say, I would say tier four too. It's a little too soft for me. A little, nice. A little, a little crunchier than I would. It would be better. Because I didn't mind the flavor. Mm -hmm. It was really mushy. Well, speaking of crunch, oh Keto Naturals oh Keto Crackers. God. Never heard of these before. Oh but they are almond flour, sea salt uh, crackers. So well, let's see what they are. Check check this rock out. and roll. Mm -hmm. Check, 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 check this no, out. No, mm-mm. Dip looks good. I just want to say, look at this guacamole. Okay, wait a minute. First of all, uh -oh. tell me the first thing, thing you notice. Yeah. Huh? What? They're not the same color. Take, no, take some of they are, and they're not the size that you, I mean, I didn't expect them to be that big, but really, That's people, what she said. Yeah, exactly. Whoa, they are even smaller than I thought. That's what she said. Exactly. <laughs> you can't even reach down to them. They're so... Okay, guys. So... These are more white. Yeah, like, look. Definitely getting cheese it, getting white cheddar situation. Like, this is not... You have one of them this is actual size the thing on the front. Enlarged for texture. Yeah. They should definitely say... Oh, it does say enlarged for so texture. <laughs> this is just original. This I guess. Sea salt. Okay. Sea salt. Okay. It does look more like a cheese it. Yeah, sea salt. Let's go for it. Here we go. I literally cannot taste anything. You know what? It's the size of a communion wafer. <laughs> Look, it's so small. Here. It's actually going to taste you know, of a communion wafer. Okay. Word. <laughs> Here's one thing I do not like. It tastes just like a communion wafer. I don't like this texture. I don't like a suck of it's a soft. stale. Right. For yeah. so me, salted stale. It's just bland, no flavor. I mean, like what you eat and do, any other things you eat. I do taste. taste the sea salt and it's okay, but okay is about. As much as I, I mean, it's a very neutral. It's not bad. I mean, to be honest, for me, that's a tier two. If somebody gave those to me, I'd eat them. Like, I really? Yeah, they weren't that bad. No, I like the, I like the saltiness though. Definitely well. put off by the difference in color, um, and the, they're really small. No wonder twenty crackers is a serving because they're like one inch by one inch. Exactly. Like, imagine how small this little ramekin guacamole <laughs> must be exactly. in order for that to be like you know to size, right? Okay. If I'm not mistaken, we're moving on to the sweets. Was that a hidden meat stick in there? No, right? no, no hidden meat stick. Okay, oh, cover meat stick. Shred food keto dippers. Yes. I know, right? I already said. Oh, oh, we know you like too. those. Mm -hmm. too. They look like waffles. What? I was like, what am I thinking of? Oh, I think I said waffles. milk duds in the other video. Waffles. Oh my gosh, but they look like chocolate covered almonds. Like they don't really look. Here. You said milk does? Yes, I think in the in the keto crate unboxing I said milk does. Well, no, well, actually they do, on the deck they look like whoppers. This yes. does look like a milk does. Oh, yeah. see, I didn't know that. See, I, I meant whopper because you see how they're glossy and uniform, mm -hmm. but then when you get these, they're not uniform mm -hmm. and they are matte. 
Mm -hmm. And then they're clearly flat. Right. Where they, you know, so that, you know, like, it's just, once again, the packaging is not matching up to what we're actually getting, right? They Ooh. sit on the surface somewhere. Exactly. Okay, let go. Let's go. It's just like a chocolate shell to like a puff of air. Mm -hmm. You know, like, bite through. I enjoy the chocolate shell. Mm-hmm. Puff of air, give it like a Rice Krispie treat kind of vibe. Mm-hmm. Tier one and a half. Like, I mean, this tastes good. I don't know if I would go as far as to buy it, but it's better than a tier two. Like, I like if I, I don't know if this is on sale. Yeah. Maybe that's tier one and a half. Would that mean tier two for me? Mm, it's no. good enough. That's good. The chocolate's oh, good. Yeah, I liked it. I would enjoy the it. Crunch. I would want it. Yeah, that was oh, wanting that. That was awesome. really good. Uh -oh. Okay, next. Fat Snacks Maple Pecan Cookie. Oh, like the meat stick. I was excited about the mapleness of it all, but the meat stick just didn't really uh. give what it needed to have given, right? So, Fat Snacks has gotten really like uniform with the size mm. of their their cookie. Oh yeah, that's a thin, that's a thin crisp, thin crisp biscuit. Mm. It is soft. They do say that it's a soft baked cookie, yes. so don't expect anything else. Okay. It's a soft bake on okay. the package. Oh my god, the maple. Smell. Right, because I smelled the maple and said, mm, oh, that's good. Okay. The bouquet. Tier two is a little bit uh, too chewy, too softy. Like it dissolved a little too fast. But I did like the maple and the peanut. Yeah, flavor wise, that's a tier one. Yeah, I like, I love sure go in one, the so flavor of that. But I also agree, I'm not a fan of the soft cookies that just dissolve in your mouth. Mm -hmm. So, like, technically, this is a tier two. I wouldn't actually buy it. But if you like maple flavored things and cookies, that was delicious. Like, that mm. was delicious. It was very flavorful. Yeah, very flavorful. Yes. <laughs> okay, look at this. Look at this next thing. Good to go chocolatey chip blondies. Ooh. Like, with maple in it. No, it's uh, chocolatey chip. But you remember, Good To Go usually makes the... Those little oonkets. Yeah, that's right? what it is, a little oonkets. Little, little, little makes the, yeah. the muffin puffs, but this time it's like a chocolate chip blondie. Oh, look at yes. that, look at the puffness. It's yeah, it is. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> but honestly, though, for the win, it looks exactly like the uh, packaging. Right? Exactly, exactly like the packaging. Thank you, Good To Go. Okay, Thank you, Good To Go. I love that I can see the chocolatey chips. Okay. Okay, let go. Let's go. Okay, that's a one. I enjoy this one. Mm. It's really nice and bitey. You know, we eat some good and you start rocking. It's not too overly chocolate, mm. but blondie in it gives it a nice mix of the hint of chocolate, but still a nice cakey. It's cakey. That's what it is. It's not really crumbly. It's just. Mm. It like stays together. Like if you if you smash that in a fork, you can lift the whole thing up, right? Because right. that's right. how it's like it's way moist. Great mm -hmm. right. with coffee. My <laughs> only issue with this is like only two of them come in here. Like this needs to. This is that was really good. I love the this softness the three, okay. of the uh, of the chocolate. I love mm -hmm. the crunch of the chocolate chip. The fact yeah, that they're like big right. chocolate chips yeah. that I'm you get. Them. Yeah, this was like delicious. Thank you. Good to go. Yeah, thank you. Good to go. As always, you are good to go. So, oh my gosh. um, yeah, I'm a fan. I'm excited. That's why I love the keto crate because it like it sh it hips us to stuff we've it's never the, tried. Oh, yeah, I would like to try it's that. Ones across yeah. the board with that. Yeah, one, right? uh, ones across the board. Yay. Way to go, Richard. Way to go, you two. Okay. Come on to my side. Okay. Next, a new item I'm excited about. Keto wise chocolate Ooh. peanut blast. It like it feels like a really Ooh. thick bar, like bars. Bars, so like it, yeah, almost like a turtle bar, though. Yeah, exactly. You know, so I've never had, yeah, I've never had this before, so and I've never seen it before, so I'm excited about it. The brand is very cool. oh wow, look at that! Like oh, when they wow. said peanut, they mean peanut. Like Keto wise, yes, exactly. Chocolate payday. Yeah. Chuck okay. no, That's not what they mean by payday. Yeah, I have to knife yours because it'll crumble apart. Exactly. I'll crumble so, for you. No. So yeah, they just keep it keeps crumbling. Yeah, it does. Keep crumbling. <laughs> um, okay. So yeah, like it did, it did pull. Hold it for your face. Hold on. It did pull, but the fact that I cut it is a very smooth cut. But I mean, like, like oh, peanuts wow. texture. Oh, texture. It's texture giving on texture on a zillion. Okay, let go. Hold your hand on okay. it. Yeah. All right, let's do this. Oh no! You gotta hold your hand. Um, I mean, yeah, I'd have to give it a one. Like, it's better than a two, you know? 
1.5. What was the flavor? Chocolate peanut blast. Yeah. Because yeah. so so I feel like there's a, ca a caramel in the middle, mm -hmm. but like you definitely get the chocolates and you definitely get the peanut. I mean, there, there are peanut halves yes. in there. Like you can't miss that. Mm -hmm. not. Next, tried and true favorite, Monk Pack. Yep, so this is oh, almond one? butter cocoa chip. Ooh, Ooh, yeah. Man. yeah. I'm very excited about this. So look at oh that looks like a typical little Kudos. Bar yeah, I mean it looks like a, just a regular kudos granola so bar. Big. So that looks nice. Yeah, like I just I knew nice. what to expect and it gives it to me every single time. Okay, let's go. Right, here we go. It's great. Eat the other half? Yeah, I did. Nice. Yeah. All right, no point in saving that morsel of a bite. That's beautiful. Mmm. Mm. It tastes coconut. Delicious. Oh, wow. Coconut. Is that the first? <laughs> that's the first ingredient. Ingredients. No, hold on. Almonds, allulose, and then coconut. No, one. okay. Yeah, mm, that was yeah. good. That was very good. Like, yes. I really, I think they should have had the word coconut in the name somewhere if it's going to taste of that. Yes. Like, I did get some chocolate. I definitely got almond butter, you know, mm -hmm. but I was like, mm, that's coconut. But, like, it's not listed anywhere on there. So. I know. Mm, tier one, though. It was delicious. The texture, the chewiness, the flavor, yeah. perfect snack. Yes. Like, one of my favorite snack bars I, out there. I would go one as well. The only problem I had is that it followed behind the turtle. Yeah, I mean, uh, comparatively. Yeah, I was like, the caramel and the peanuts kind of knocked me over my feet. Mm -hmm. and, right. Um, going from that to that, it would have been a great bar. It was still a tier one, but now I'm like, 1.8? <laughs> yeah. Okay, penultimately... RossChocolates.ca. Oh my god. I love Ross Chocolates. Yeah. Not dossier. RossChocolates.ca. <laughs> Mom, do you know what a dossier is? It makes no logical sense. <laughs> <laughs> this is just milk chocolate minis. Oh my gosh. Right yeah. Now? No, they're not wrapped, okay. but they're individual oh, squares. So yeah. Cute. Mm -hmm. Do not put this No, in it's not car. dossier. Uh, yeah, it'll all just melt into yeah, one block. Yeah, one big chocolate. <laughs> yeah. They're yeah. really cute. Yeah, these squares are cute. See, this is what size the cracker should oh, be. No, exactly. You know, like, this is... Yes. Yes. Keto natural. And made of chocolate. All right, hello. <laughs> <laughs> that would also improve. Okay, let's go. Mmm. Mmm. Nice. Perfect. Yeah, completely perfect. Tier one. Wonderful. Like a Hershey bar. Yeah, I mean, amazing. Mm. It's Dossier. No, no, that's not a thing. Every single time, like you just know what to expect. It was great. Was one Tier well. one, that was great. It was a pretty good piece of chocolate. Yeah, it was just delicious. sugar free, but milk chocolate, so not I'm bitter. Exactly. Like I'm still, like, it really is scarily close to Hershey's. Yeah, tight. Real like, sugared scary chocolate. Close. Mm. Okay, Tier one, that was great. Yep. I love you, Ross Chocolates Dossier. Finally, we are ending. What are we? Okay. What? Chalk Zero. Yeah. Oh Double dipped almonds, mm -hmm. milk, and coconut. So, like, dip that twice. These are almonds. Like, I've never seen coconut or heard. Milk. Yeah, I've never seen or heard this before. And look, they look. They come in fingers. Oh. Balls. They did this just Ball. for Halloween. So, look how great these are. So, chocolate nice. chocolate, and, and, like, coconut covered almonds. So, let's go. Mm -hmm. Well, this is about to go. I mean, yeah, plus, it's just like first of all, there's no dog hair on the ground. Secondly, this, this is what the shrewd food should look like. Glossy oh, finish. Yeah, right. right? Like, well, it's shiny. Okay, you ready? Yes. Let's go. Yes. Oh my God. Is it an mm. almond joy? You tell me. I'm, I'm enjoying the almonds, this. The almonds are still crunchy. Yeah. That's but there's clearly like a soft Ooh, coconutty. This is nice. It really is an almond joy. Oh, mmm. Yeah. Yeah. It's a personal almond joy. Yeah, like it was an individual packaged almond mm -hmm. joy. I have to agree. Look at that chop zero. Doing yeah. the dog on fine. That was really good. And somehow nice. they laid, they made it. Here, one for the, the almond. Oh, yeah. The almond doesn't get soggy. Does the road mean here no. now? Mm -mm. No. Um, tier one. Those oh. are delicious. Like, I do think it's laughable that they package them in twos. And they're just like, like they so should have just cute. thrown those all 
all in like a big bag, you know? But other than that, everything about that was absolutely delicious. The chocolate was delicious. The texture of the coconut, the almond in the middle. The crunch of the almond. Yeah, winner. Winner, winner, chocolate almond ball. Like, they, they had the almonds. You could take a little mound of the coconut, crush it to create a well, Put it in there, close it around, and then oh dip that in chocolate. God. Yeah, I no, they didn't bake baker, anything around it. Oh, awesome. yeah. I love that. No. <laughs> Ooh, I'm glad this is over. And do you know why else I'm glad? Because somebody right. watching gets to like win this. Like somebody gets to try mm -hmm. all yes. of these things, right? And that person is. Look, guys, congratulations. This oh is a great you. keto crate. If you did not win, if this person is not you right now, do not fret. Yeah. Click the link in the description to order this crate now. So not now, good. right now. Like, so this is great. I mean, oh, so was... many great things. Yeah, like, yeah, like, went out on a babe. Oh, yeah. gracious. Uh, that was so good. The keto wise was oh, delicious. Well, no, you always hold up the thing nobody <laughs> wants. First of all, no. Okay. Oh, and this was. Delicious. Okay, we can stop going through them now. Ooh. Everything was great. Okay, put it back down. Nope, thank you. Thank All right. Yes. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, comment down below, have you tried? Like, what did you try? What did you enjoy? Or what would you still most like to try? Let me know. Also, whoever won, email me at watchoutomketo at gmail.com, right? Forgot to mention that. Um, but have a great month, everyone, and we'll check you out next month. It'll be Christmas time. Yes! yes. Bye! Bye, y'all. Ross-chocolates.ca <laughs> To me, ugh. Mm. Nasty. No, oh, no. <laughs> What's wrong with you? <laughs> that you scared me. <laughs> okay. I have to take that away from you two ladies <gasps> because you're going to lose your minds. <laughs> <laughs> Dot C A. You can't see my <laughs> You can't even see that. What was your vote? No, I thought a 1.5. Oh, well, yeah. She gave numbers yeah. after. Mm -hmm. she, she gave numbers. <laughs> okay.